In this lesson, we'll talk a little bit about hidden lines. And there's kind of some different, very different meanings for what is a hidden line. First of all, you can hide a line using the line type thing. Very different, but it's still a hidden line. So watch, if I go up to modify and I go to the line work tool, I can go in here and say hidden line, right? And then what I can do is I can pick on a line and it'll hide it. Okay, there's stuff underneath it, but okay, I can go in and create hidden lines, or I can say invisible lines. Okay, visible lines are different because they actually make them invisible. Don't get invisible mixed up with hidden. Okay, so hidden line is a dashed line, invisible line is a clear line. So that's just overriding a line type. Okay. Now, the other type is hidden lines when it's being obscured. When something's in the way of it, you can have it kind of show through. Watch. Let's just go to a 3D view. And before I show some hidden lines coming through, we want to take one look at our object styles. If we go to Manage on the top, and we go up here to Object Styles, you're going to see all the different categories walls, doors, we, uh, ceilings, you're going to see this hidden line, hidden line, column, hidden lines, conduit, none, I happen to pick one, um, not detailed, duct fittings, center lines, ducts, okay, center lines, they don't have hidden lines, floors, you'll see hidden lines, okay, furniture, Hidden lines, generic models, hidden lines. And then it's going to say, well, hidden lines are this line weight and this color and this line type. So that's how they're going to look. Okay. So each category has a hidden line, preset, line weight, line color, and line pattern. So what happens is if we go in here, for instance, and I want to have something show through as a hidden line, watch, I can go up to my... Um, view tab and I can say show hidden lines okay turn it on and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to say uh, I'm going to use the modify tool and I'm going to grab my hidden lines tool which is right here no um, and actually what you have to do is I'm not reading my status bar when you say show hidden lines what you have to do is pick the item that you want the hidden lines to show through and then after that you pick the item you want to um, show as hidden but the problem with this is I can't pick anything inside of there because I can't pick that wall through it so what I'm going to do is temporarily hit escape I'm going to change my view just to be wireframe just for a second now I'm going to do it again show hidden lines through this same roof and then I'm going to pick on this wall and I'm going to say multiple to do more than one and pick this guy and this guy. Okay. And then hit escape. Now let's go back to our regular view. And we're going to see that hidden line. The other ones didn't work. Let's try that again. Change this back to be wireframe so I can select my elements. Okay. Show hidden line. Pick the roof, and then I have my multiple on. Now I pick this guy, and I pick this guy, right? And then switch this back to be hidden line, and escape, escape, and those guys are going to show through as hidden lines like that. So a little bit um, tricky to do. It works better when you're in, in details and sections where something's behind something and you want it to show through. That's where you use this show hidden lines. First, you pick the element you want it to show through. After you do it, if you click on here, if you hover, you read your status bar. It says, um, I'm hovering over something. If you start that tool and you hover over nothing, the status bar will tell you to first pick selected item to show the hidden line through. And then after you do that, then you pick the item that you want to show as hidden. So um, each category has a different, if you want it red or dashed or green or 
change the way a hidden line looks, you need to go up to your back to your manage and then back to your object styles. Find the category you want, such as columns. Change the hidden lines to be, you know, green. And uh, instead of dashed, you pick a different, you know, line type and hit OK. So if you do show hidden and you pick a surface and then pick a column, it'll show up as a green dotted line instead of a regular dashed line.